Hello everyone, I'm Alexander. I'll bring you here the demo of Venture to the Vile for PC. So, this demo will be on Steam Next Fest, but I got access before of it. Uh, it's a game that I follow because when they show it, it was pretty cool. Or the, at least what they show from there, like, it, it captured my interest on this game. Uh, so basically it's like, uh, you know, side scroll, platform, action, you heal like it is like uh, souls like that, you know, you have certain amount of potions that you can heal and then like if you want to replenish you need to sleep and then it's spawn, you know. I'm not gonna say it's a souls like game, no it's not, at least for me it's not, but uh, it has some mechanics of, uh, you know, souls, but it looks interesting. Of course, this is a demo, of course, there's stuff missing, you know, things like that. The game is supposed to come out on next year. I don't think it will be early next year, it will be like, uh, probably mid, something like that. So as you can see, the game puts you in mid like this. You can play with gamepad or uh, keyboard, you change press E and you can see what are the buttons. T to wheel, R to parry, E to tentacle grab, Q to interact, slash, dash. Hopefully you can uh, change the key bindings, you know. But for now on them you can't, but hopefully in the full game you'll be able to, to uh, key bind. Like, uh, because I would love to get dash on shift and not F, you know. And probably like tentacle grab you could put on, left, on right mouse button, you know, or parry into there. You know, something like that, but... It's a dam, so you cannot ask for that much, you know. Dam, it's a dam. A candle was lit in tribute for the Institute. See, because uh, on the top left you have the hearts, that is uh, your uh, health, and you have two potions that will. Once you heal, you need to replenish that, you need to go to sleep. Press start to see the boot, the controls, you can double jump. It looks like the parry is the best thing, because it can insta kill enemies. Say insta kill. So. I don't know if it's only for the demo that is like that, or if in the full game at least it's gonna be like this. What? You can kill both enemies like that with a parry? With a parry to one enemy can kill other ones? What the fuck? Didn't even know that. But I think you can only parry to ones that uh, blink red. I think it's only those ones. These ones. I think it's only those ones that you can parry. And the window of the parry is not short, nothing like that. It's like a little bit... Uh, it's a, a good window, you know, to parry. I'm not gonna say it's too big. Probably they can shorten a little bit, you know? But... Uh, it's good. Here rests the good lady in uh, Jack Dow, no for her kindness, standing to the poor. She fed all the hungry and nursed all the sick, always where she was needed, fast and quick. Now her candle is gone and people unfed. She lies cold in the ground, still and quiet, uh, quite dead. So it looks like you need to light all those candles. It's what it looks like, the objective on this place, of course. In a, I don't think in the demo you can do that. I don't think it is possible. Here lies King Duke of the Woods, he helped his people wherever he could. He was adored by his searchers, both rich and poor. They will all bow before him, nose to the floor. Even the brothers will go their knees, as under his rule they were happy and free. I don't know what is these things for. It looks like it's like currency of the game. These uh, orbs. Must be the currency for the, uh, for the game. 
but basically our character has these uh, powers because he's get uh, like the darkness or something like that touch him grabs him by the arm and we get the, the, like this power if you see the trailer that they have on the on steam you can see how it gets this power in case you wonder Press right one for a back step and then same like that. Because in this guy you cannot parry if I'm not mistaken, because it says to parry is when there's that uh, blink red blink. That's how you parry. When that like that. That's when you can parry. Which means like you cannot parry everything. Which like uh, that that's cool that at least you cannot parry everything that you that you see every attack. Like you need to be careful with uh, what you do. Like the parry can be good to insta kill enemies at least in this part, but not every move can be uh, parried. I wonder if against boss you can parry, you know? So this is to, to sleep. Like I say, you can replenish your healing in there. And enemies of course spawn. Now I don't know if I got all the candles lit. Only if it's like one missing. Shit. Holy shit that these guys explode. Okay. about forward, I didn't saw forward. Aha. Oh, look at that, that's a giant one. Yeah, can I go for that? I think I got all of them turned on. That was like in the ground, so... Yeah, everything is turned on, right? Oh, but it doesn't happen, nothing? Oh, okay. Thought something will happen.
go over here, you cannot pass. Uh, rear area closer for them, come back, check it at the launch. This one it is. Oof. Sleep, replenish my potions. The enemies respawn, like I said. We have a boss, a centipede. Now we have to run. It was a, dash, a small centipede, it's something big. Now this part I don't know. See this part I don't understand very well how it works. Like how what the hell do you expect you to do from here? This part over here is weird, like you uh, you cannot aim. So it's weird what the hell they want you to do in there. You cannot be that high. It's very weird. It's like it's missing a platform or something like that. I don't know. What? Oh no, that missed me. What? Where's my other input? Double jump. Double jump. See, uh, how, how you can get high? That's how you can get high. Yeah. What? Yeah, I 
it's like I don't I don't know like it's missing something in there like you need to aim to where you want to go uh, with that It's like it's missing a platform or something for you to be able to reach to there. See, why now it goes down? Because you cannot get another one. Yeah. What? See that, that but this part needs to be uh, different. It cannot be like that. It is very, very weird. It's like you, you need to be able to aim to where you want to go. And now it looks like he absorbs the power or something like that from the monster, from the boss. It's like, it's interesting like the calm, but it's like, you know, being able to parry, uh, attack, will, will we have different abilities besides that, you know. It has that potential, that part, that boss needs to be different in my opinion, like it, that part cannot be like that because it's like, how the hell I go up if that is only to boost you forward, you know? So it's a little bit weird, it's not supposed to be like that, uh, but it has that potential, now it's like, will they be able to, to pull it? It's a matter of waiting and see. But uh, yeah, like... The dam is supposed to be on Steam Next Fest, but you know how it is. Like sometimes there is dams coming out before the Steam Next Fest that are supposed to be on Steam Next Fest. So uh, you're gonna be able pro to play a little bit earlier than Steam Next Fest. But uh, if you like these type of games, like uh, side scroll action, I don't know if it will have puzzles or not. I think it will because I think in Steam page they say puzzles, so probably we're gonna have that to to do. Uh, boss fights, of course, probably you're gonna have boss fights, it has to, it has to have. Yeah, and then some, I'm gonna say, souls mechanics, that that part of restoring up your uh, healing, your enemies spawning, you know. Uh, you're probably gonna enjoy, but of course, the full game, only next year, the damn Steam Next Fest. So, hope you guys enjoyed, see you guys next time. Bye.